See? Ito na lang natira because Why my son-in-law had how many? Three. Three. Plate, eh. Three and <laughs> change Why? plate because... Plate. Hello everyone! We are doing another recipe today. I would say good morning to all because it's really early in the morning today. It's a Sunday while I'm shooting this vlog and the reason why we have to start cooking early is because the kids are coming over for lunch and today we are going to be baking chicken. And it takes quite some time to bake. I'm going to need 30 minutes preparation plus an hour, an hour and a half to bake. So it's going to take some time and most of the time when the kids come here, at 12 noon on Sundays, they're very hungry and they're all nagmamadin kumain. So we have to start shooting this vlog early in the morning. I want to thank my son again for waking up for me. Anyway, today is a recipe that I also just learned very recently. So I do some research, I watch YouTube, and I want to learn how to make different kinds of big chicken. My children have a favorite. But I'm not preparing that today. I'm going to do something new because I want to surprise them. Gusto ko iba naman yung panlasa ng baked chicken sa kanila. Hindi yung paulit-ulit lang ako. But I will be sharing with you also one of these days yung paboritong baked chicken ng anak ko. But today, we're going to do something that will taste really fresh. Okay, we would call this recipe lemon garlic Greek chicken. Sounds fancy, diba? But I really want to just try new things. We're going to need lots of a lemon. I'm going to juice the lemon. This is squeeze ko siya. So that's where the, the, the taste of freshness will come in. Then I'm going to put dry spices. And I know that we have spices at home naman available, diba? Now, these spices will be bahala kayo kung anong gusto niyo, kung ano yung mga preferred niyo. But for me, today, I'm going to be using ground cumin. So it has that Middle Eastern smell, that spice. Pero masarap siya pag sinabay mo siya sa lemon. I practiced this a few days ago and then I have rosemary, we have thyme, okay? And then when I do chicken or I marinate meat, it's always rock salt. And then I have cloves of garlic, which I'm going to be grating later. And then I have a few potatoes because my son loves potatoes. I soaked it in water first, but I should not brown. And then of course, pepper will never disappear. And then I have a crushed red pepper. This one so that adds to the kick and today because I am going to be baking I'm using my Doña Elena olive oil which I'm using pomas today because the olive oil of Doña Elena na pomas is best for roasting and for frying and it's gonna really just bring out the flavor this is one of our main ingredients plus of course this meal is gonna be very healthy you know that we're so into lemons nowadays plus all of this everything is healthy and then I'm gonna use chicken thigh Okay, this has been cleaned already. I, I cleaned this already. Let's start the process. Okay, so first we have to start by washing our hands because we're going to be using this in marinating the chicken. Okay, now we have to make sure that the chicken is really dry. So using this, we have to pat it dry. Para maganda siya pag bake Okay, I need my Pyrex, kuya. Okay, we're going to leave space in between because I'm going to put potatoes. So for one Pyrex, oh no, these are big chicken thighs. So I think kakasha dito ilang peraso na. Six lang? I was hoping eight, but let's try because my kids eat so much. <laughs> okay. We have dried the chicken a little bit, okay? Para hindi siya basang basa. And then now, I'm going to be cutting the potatoes. Okay, let me explain. I have so much chicken here, but one Pyrex, one large Pyrex would be good for four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, supposedly eight now. Okay, but since I'm feeding all of my children and they can eat three pieces in one time, I have to make two Pyrex. But I'm going to be sharing with you the recipe for one Pyrex first. So, pinagpilitan ko ang nine pieces. Nine pieces of thigh. Okay, dapat hindi. But let's see how it goes. Okay, now, I'm going to make the marinade, the lemon sauce, okay? Alright, so now we're going to start off, after we dry the chicken, we're going to start doing the lemon sauce or the marinade, okay? So for one Pyrex of eight to nine pieces of 
chicken thigh, I'm going to use six whole lemons, okay? So we're just gonna slice it up. Okay, six, no? Okay, I hope it's... They said you do this. Para lumabas yung juice mo na ng konti. Okay, these lemons have been washed already. Now, ija juice ko siya. Okay, I borrowed this uh, lemon squeezer from Julia. Nice. <laughs> okay, so we're going to do six of this for one Pyrex. Okay, so masakit na yung aking kamay. I have successfully squeezed 12 lemons, six for each recipe. Okay, one Pyrex, six lemons. Now, we're going to start with the marinade. So the juice of six is here. Now I'm going to get my Doña Elena pomace oil. Uh, sorry, pomas oil. Pomas oil because this is good for roasting and frying. You know this olive oil and Doña Elena, ito yung ginagamit natin yung pomas. Pag nagpiprito tayo ng mga pork chop, ng mga bacon, and now it's also good for roasting. So that's what, exactly what we're gonna do. For six lemons, we are going to need one cup of olive oil. Sobrang healthy. Diba? We have lemon and then we have olive oil pa. There you go. Okay, so we're going to put it together. Okay, lemon and pomas olive oil. Alright, and then, wait, I'm gonna do it for the other recipe also. Because remember, two Pyrex for my kids. There. Alright, so, you know, it's really good to be watching YouTube. Eh? Because you learn different recipes from different cultures, different people. And then, bahala ka na, pag mahili ka na magluto, alam naman paano mag-replace ng ingredients to your liking. So, I have my lemon juice, I have my olive oil. Now, I'm going to use five cloves, okay? For one Pyrex, five cloves ako, ha? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I'm going to grate it. Okay, mas masarap pala siya pag grate it. Ngayon ko lang nalaman, mas masarap. Kasi diba dati, we mince it, diba? Pero ito, pagka grate it, i-infuse talaga yung kanyang garlic. Flavor. I'll use five cloves for this because I really like garlic, you know that, no? For those who really watch my vlogs, I love garlic. And then lemon pa, ah, oh, sarap. Diba? Love. We can do this also for our garlic bread. Diba? I grate natin yung garlic instead of just mincing it, diba? Oh, this is so sarap. Once it's roasted, you're going to smell the lemon and then the cumin. It has its Middle Eastern smell. Should be big pa lang na amoy ko eh. For those who are mixing your dry spices, the success of most of my baked chicken, I use paprika. But in this recipe, we don't. But there's that option. But you use paprika instead of cumin. You know, sinabi sa cooking show na napanood ko. Alright, okay, there you go. Oh, there, there, there. Okay, so we have our lemon juice here. We have our pomas, olive oil, and our grated garlic. We're gonna whisk it. Yes. Napakasarap. Parang, parang feeling ko pwede na rin pang salad dressing to eh. Yung ito lang, kuya, hindi na kailangan ko rin. Okay, so I'm going to leave it now. Now, I'm going to cut some potatoes. Okay, so we'll just cube, okay? Sabi nga dun sa natutunan ko. Cube na lang natin para mas mabilis siyang ma like maluto. Oo, oo. Tapos, alam mo, dapat hindi siya maliliit, no? But, ha? You like it like this? That's nice. Okay, we're going to do it this size, kuya, para ito get cooked faster so that you don't get beaten. Okay, so sana magkasya, ha? So I really love it when my kids come here. Sunday's my favorite day of the week. I've been so happy because I have had so much time to go over our family recipes and then try to remember ano ba yung mga namimiss ko ng mga kinakain na nung kabataan ko. And so now we've been preparing it and sharing it on my vlog. And then of course, kailangan naman may bago na tayong mga specialties. So we watch, we research, we learn, and I've learned new recipes that I can, you know, para naman mabago yung no, panrasa ng mga bata. Hindi naman yung pagulit-ulit yung mga pagulit nila na lang ng bata sila. Okay, so we're almost done with the potatoes. Okay, so since ang dami kong chicken, crowded na siya. So, I'm not gonna fill it up na with too much potato, sadly, kuya. What I like about this recipe is, pagka na-marinate mo, hindi mo na patatagalin. My other baked chicken dish kasi, kailangan ko pa siya i-pan fry bago i-bake. So, talagang tedious eh. It takes up so much of my time. So, that's why I like this recipe kasi, pagka na-marinate ko na ito, diretsyo na. Alright, we're going to try this chicken. 
All right, I whisk it. What I will do is I will pour a little bit. Yeah. Okay, not all. I'll pour a little bit and then, okay, so for one recipe, Kuya, there you see it. It's at least one teaspoon like this. I hope it's enough. I'm not sure, but that's good for one Pyrex, okay? I'm gonna put my cumin. I'm gonna put my rock salt. I put a little bit more salt than the cumin and all. And then thyme and my rosemary. And then nakakapagod na sumakit na yung kamay ko sa lemon. <laughs> so bakit nasa kaka-squeeze ng lemon? So I'm not gonna use my pepper ano. I'm going to just get ground pepper na may konti buo-buo pa eh. And I will add it here. Okay. Of course we need pepper. Let's mix. I think I want to add more rock salt, no? Okay, halik again. Tansya-tansya. Moms, magtansya-tansya lang tayo. Okay. Alright, there. But basically, one teaspoon ang ginamit ko for the eight pieces of chicken. Okay, now, I put half of the marinade na I'm going to put here. There you go. Pati sa potatoes. Balik na rin ko siya para marinate rin siya. Nagpe-preheat na kami ng oven for 10 minutes. Okay, this is gonna be so good. It's uh, actually um, a Greek recipe. Okay, there you go. One teaspoon of each for eight to nine slices. Okay, so massage, massage. Yan. I really wanna make sure that the ng chicken yung know, spices. We're done, we're done. There. Okay, so even the potatoes are infused. There you go. And then, we're going to put back the remaining marinade. There. Okay. Now, the lemon will make it really soft. The marinade niya will make it really soft. So we're going to, I'm going to add a little bit of water, okay? Now that we've put na all our remaining marinade, half kanina, then the dry spices, massage, massage, and then we put the remaining half of the marinade. We'll just add a little bit of water para hindi siya mag konti lang, konti lang para hindi mag dry up. And we're ready. This is ready. We have already preheated our oven. Okay, I will show you how we do it. Iba iba tayo ng oven, okay? So to be honest with all of you, yung oven namin sa tagal na, na sa amin na puro na sa kakalinis na puro na yung numbers. So, basta ang ginagawa ko nalang, tansya, tansya rin. So, kung ganun kayo, yung oven nyo is nabura na yung number. Just put it todo, preheat for 10 minutes, and then todo na for 1 hour. That's it. Tapos. That's how we did it. So, this is one. I'm going to spice it up a bit. And then, I'm going to finish up the second. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hindi pa pala ako tapos. I almost forgot. I'm going to do this. Of course, our lemon has been already cleaned well, diba? I will do this for decor purposes. And syempre, ano rin, para maganda tignan, isasama ko na siya sa baking, diba? And then you notice that in this recipe, hindi na ako nagdagdag ng butter. Nahiya na ako maglagay ng butter. Sobrang malinamnam na nito. No need for butter. I put two lemons. Now this is just me. Uh, parang hindi ako happy na hindi ko nakikita yung spices kasi na mix ko na na. I'll just put a little bit on top. I like it that way na may nakikita ako mong spices. What's that one? This one is rosemary. And then I'm gonna add thyme again. And then I'll put ano. Gusto ko nakikita may pepper sa taa. Hindi yung skin, di ba? Pagkatapos mag-bake. Gusto ko nakikita may pepper. So nice. So pretty! Okay, there you go. And then I'll put the red chili flakes. Okay. Para may kick siya. My bite and my kick. Ang sarap nito. Okay, one fire eggs, ready to bake. Okay, we're going to bring it to my kitchen. Ito yung kitchen ko na. My oven. Isa kasi just done. Okay, see? This is what I told you. <laughs> you show. Um, medyo nabura-bura na. Okay, pasok na natin ito. We're going to put it into layers. Ooh, hot! So, it's here now, and we're going to bake it for one hour. Good luck! I hope my kids are not that hungry. You knock so loud. <laughs> hey. Was I supposed to knock slow? Yeah, <laughs> this is a vlog. Okay, here I knock. Wait, wait, say hi to Millie Bear. <laughs> I just woke up in the car. Where's Lala? Where's Lala? Hi! Where's your outfit? So cute! I just woke up. Yeah! 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 Ye
use of world's prettiest granddaughter. <laughs> There's ube pandesal if you're hungry. Appetizers. Darling, why do you I'm gonna eat. I'm starving. Yeah, go, go. Darling, happy birthday. Tried, we have a cake for you because it's your birthday. Oh, it's lemon. Wait, she likes the vlogging yes. camera. So I should try to reach for it. She likes the camera. I think she's used to see. There's the world's most beautiful young daughter who looks like a baby doll. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Who's that baby doll? Yeah. Baby, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Lily Bird. It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Lily Bird. Yay, nice. <laughs> she knows how to hold the camera. Hey guys, okay. my name Vlogger is baby. Millie Vanilli. Today, Our famous Millie Vanilli with today her is a typical famous Sunday. <laughs> You're so pretty. Oh, you have to see on the camera. Look. What are you vlogging? Oh, say hi. My I'm mom the has the house of my Lala. My mom has taught me how to vlog. Welcome to my YouTube channel. <laughs> Oi! So cute. <laughs> baby That's Lana's vlog. Say hi. So cute. Please subscribe. Please <laughs> subscribe. Show her to us one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm talking about you in Tagalog, so you won't understand. You can shut the clips to add there. This is it. You understand? Lily, hindi ka natakot sa amo. Kila damo na ako. You understand, Lily? Okay, we're going to look at this. Oh. Pwede na. Ilang minutes pa to. I think we started again. No? Look at that. A few more minutes pa. Lovely. Okay, so for the others, it's 425 degrees Fahrenheit for 45 minutes. You can raise it to 450 degrees Fahrenheit for an hour. Pero kami, ba, since there's no number, todo na lang for one hour. Para safe. <laughs> so we're so excited. We're hungry na. Oh, look at that. Hat. Wow, that looks so good. Uh, Mom's so excited to eat. Let's eat. Oil it up. Oil it up. This is olive oil and lemon. Oil it. Up. Okay. Oh. Okay. Happy. Which you. chicken do you want? Not so particular. I'll just so grab this one. Okay. So by Taya Bay. Nako. Baka ba init ha? Bongo. Super bongo. Ready? Hot mo wow. So good bro. You like that? You like that lemony garlic? Mm -hmm. Huh? My favorite lamb. Yeah, Sarah. Favorite. Favorite? It's so it's so fresh and zesty and yeah. it's so good. It's sarap ng potato. My review pa. No, the the oh, aftertaste. The, the aftertaste is so good. Like my mouth feels so clean. Yeah, <laughs> my mouth is so clean. Me too. <laughs> Me too. So it leaves you with good breath. Yeah. So you, you like pala lemony and garlicky. Yeah, recipes. it worked well. It worked well. You think that garlic and lemon won't but go well, but it really yeah. goes well. No, and it's not dry. It's yeah, very it's moist. Not dry. Mm -hmm. It should be healthy because it's lemon and olive oil. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right? And garlic. Right. The tanginess is so perfect. And yeah. the spices. Really yeah. like it. Yay. Yeah. Thank you. Yay. So, something that I can prepare for the kids. Yeah. So, thank you, everybody. Bye. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday.